Okay, I've got a question here. This is regarding chocolate. Is it okay since so in the coaching group? Uh, is it okay to have some since I do feel it gives some energy? Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Not all chocolate is created equal. You can have the cacao powder. You can have the dairy milk chocolate. You can have the vegan chocolate. You can have all different types of chocolate when you walk into a supermarket. Etc. You have all different types of chocolates on the shelf. In terms of consumption, I would say, uh, for me personally, I'm quite a sensitive little petal when it comes to caffeine and theobromine. So I do my best to minimize my cacao product consumption. Yes, I do have it on occasion. Uh, so I would say if chocolate's working for you, then crank the chocolate. If it's not, then do what I do and avoid it or have minimal amounts. Uh, so yeah, but also I find as well, uh, the best chocolate, if you're gonna have chocolate, is definitely gonna be a vegan chocolate uh, because it doesn't have the lactose in there. And again, we're not talking about the ethics or the environmental cost of dairy. Yeah, production in the industry. We're just purely talking about, uh, I mean, that's obviously a discussion, but in this context, people are thinking just purely on health. So I would say that uh, chocolate can have a place, but uh, if you have a little bit here and there, but I'm going to say go with the vegan options, but the less chocolate you eat, the better your health will be because, you know, you, the theobromine does affect your sleep quality. And sleep quality is very, very important for health. So chocolate, less is definitely more. Maybe it's a bit of a vague answer, but if you can cut chocolate out, even better.